These whales drew quite a crowd, and we watched as one of them swam back to the Pacific Ocean. Watch. Air 7 HD captured that moment as we see one of the two gray whales swim right back where the marine mammal came from, the Pacific Ocean, but less than an hour before. With cameras out, these amateur whale watchers waited patiently, hoping to catch a glimpse of the waterbound visitors in the San Gabriel River near Seal Beach. I've been on boats. I've never seen it up close like this, so it's amazing. It's beautiful. She even tried to FaceTime a sighting. My mom actually called me from Banning, and she was like, you need to go down to the beach. There's whales. I've been thinking about doing a whale watching trip, um, but yeah, I didn't expect to see one this close. Lifeguards noticed the whales begin to draw a crowd around 10 this morning. I was just amazed because I've never seen a whale like out in the wild ever in my life and then seeing them it just it touched me. <laughs> a coordinator from the National Oceanic and Atmospheric Administration says the whales behavior seemed pretty normal. The two gray whales about 22 feet in length seem healthy. We saw the helicopters earlier, but we didn't know what it was. I was like, oh, they're just a bunch of sharks or whatever. <laughs> so we didn't know. Just a little humpback when it was like spouting out, but I've never actually seen a whale that close. I've seen dolphins, but not whales. <laughs> As for why they swam into the mouth of the river, experts say there's a host of possibilities. The gentle giants could be feeding or keeping close to the shores. They migrate with calves or even scratching their back on the sand to remove barnacles. Whatever the reason, the site had this Man glued to a spot on the rocks as the sun set. It was less than six feet away from the shore. It was amazing. As far as we know, both whales made it back to the Pacific. Some of the whale watchers were sad to see them go, but others glad that they made it back home unharmed and healthy.